Well, we lost a true original last week, Martin Plissner. He was a pioneer at exit polling and other election innovations, and for many years he was the political director at CBS News. He died at the age of 87. Marty knew more politicians, political operatives, insiders, outsiders, and hangers-on than any one person I ever knew. Better yet, they knew him. Even after he retired in 1997, he was still the person I would call if I wanted to track down someone connected with a campaign. Marty was not like the others or anyone else I ever knew. He was as bad at driving a car as he was good at politics. To him, rules of the road were simply suggestions. He thought traffic lights were some sort of roadside decorations. When he offered you a ride, you'd get a good political discussion, but it was safer to take a cab, and no wonder. As far as I could tell, he thought little about anything but politics. Someone once said if the Russians launched a nuclear missile attack, Marty would focus on the political fallout. He was not the most orderly of thinkers. He once filed a half-eaten plate of fried chicken on a shelf of political notebooks. It was found months later. But when it came to politics, he could remember details that most of us forgot or never knew. He was the encyclopedia of little-known facts and details that set a story apart. When polling became an important part of politics, it was Marty who coined the phrase, too close to call. He was also just a wonderful guy and a great late-night company to be in when reporters got together on the campaign trail. He will not be soon forgotten.